the more I'm so fascinating, fascinating about watching this anime, it's not just because the characters based on this anime, Elf of the Me Elf of the Memories of season one, and there is a season two. That's for what I for what I see searching for this anime, but uh, I wanted to get back on this. I really want to want to watch it, but I have to say. Like I said, it's not just the character spaces and that has me really so amazed about the storyline and this, this stuff. Is basically is the graphics. The graphics are just like unbelievable, really, really good. I've never seen the, by showing different panels of of uh, uh, basically in in the anime, you know, like different graphics that they really do have and stuff like that. And I was even quite surprised that, that to show some black and white also as well too. You know, they don't show really all the time, but sometimes they really do show it because it really does shows. It really just shows like, like it's basically kind of like it's basically kind of like you. It's basically kind of like yeah, you're watching an anime that is different, but it's more to it than that. It's different. I think this anime is very very special, and I really do think so. I don't know what year is this anime that really actually is. I think this is like two thousand nine or or something like that, or this is oh okay two thousand seven. Okay, who's the studio? Studio Shop, okay. Now, uh, definitely, definitely, um, people probably don't like Studio Shop, but I do, I do like them. They're pretty good. They're not the best. They're not the best, but, but, I mean, they really are not. They, they really are not the very best for the best, but even though, even though, it definitely, it definitely has a very good reputation. Sometimes they're good with the anime, sometimes they're not, but even though, even though based with this anime, I know this base seems kind of early for me, for me saying, it, saying this, I consider this anime 100% perfect it's it's really, really good i never seen like you know based with these basically the interactions especially with the characters and stuff like that with the mcs and stuff like that and you know just showing the graphics of different like how they look and how they spotlight how they spotlight the you know the people based on this anime also as well too it's just absolutely just gorgeous it really actually is it really actually is. The romance is definitely i mean high tier i mean we're talking about high tier High tier romance in this anime that you never you actually would see than any other anime also as well too. I mean it's really good. I mean it's really 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 really, really good. And you know, I think some people may not may not watch this anime because it may not be for them. It may be for me. It may be for anybody else. But it may not be for everyone because some people some people may get thrown off because of the animation of the animation. But some people may choose may choose the dialogue basically just basically of different of each character's basic anime. And stuff like that, but even though just based, just to be honest with you, like I said before, I don't think this anime is not just based on based on the story of romance and stuff. It's basically just showing different genres based in the anime, you know, based on each different character, basically, basically, you know, like what do they feel, how they feel, or anything like that. One one thing really caught me by surprise about what this episode episode three. I want to say this. I want to say this. Because I think this makes a lot of good sense. Because I can't remember the name of the girl. I think she has like long hair. She's wearing some bows in her, in her hair, and she basically said she basically said that, like when when you go on the ride, when you go on the ride for someone, so when you're basically in the car or whatever it may be, is is that don't you feel don't you feel the sense don't you feel the sense of that being different? Is it, is it being is it being different that being different right around? Go, I mean, you know, sitting around right. Uh, how should I say this? Uh, sitting around with with someone you know, who is different. I mean, you may not even know the person. You may you may even know the person because it's kind of like a sixth sense. That's what it kind of is. Kind of really actually is. I know that's hard for hard for me to base to really understand. It's just basically basically to see. But it just feels like it just feels like you have this. You basically you just have this feeling like who's this person really actually is? Is this person? It's a threat or or anything like that. Sometimes I do feel like that. Sometimes I do feel like that. But it's not it's not just because like oh yeah you have powers and stuff like that. No, it's just basically it's just basically yeah you know if you feel more comfortable being around a person that like if this person is going to be bad or good nobody doesn't nobody doesn't even know. But I really do like the fact really do like the fact that every different each person was ba was basically is born is basically born I would say a special gift special gift even though some people may not believe and god i was born with it i was born with a gift i didn't fully discover until you know based like last month or a couple months of uh, of that was the gift of love you know i love people i love uh, i love people i love to talk to people i really, really do i'm just a really kind person i don't have no hate anyone towards 
towards anyone. I really, really don't. You know, and so, so, sometimes, sometimes I can get a little edgy. So sometimes, but I try, but I try not to let it bother me. But I try, I'm, I'm, I try, I, I don't. But even though, even though it's just basically, it's just basically that we're all blessed with a gift. You know, that's just what what I think. You know, based on what God gave me. I'm not saying I'm special or anything like that. I'm not saying that. I'm just blessed. You know, to, to have a family, friends who love me. And, and stuff like that. I made it sound like a bragging, but it's just something. It's just something that I feel that that's basically what I feel. I understand that some people really don't believe in God. I don't mean to mention that basically here in anime, but the reason I mention this is because it's because like you know, being being with something someone different, it really can change the aurora or the aurora of the atmosphere. It's just based on, like how do you feel being around this person? Can you trust this person? Can you not trust this person? Is this is this person like the same as you know, as your friend? No, it's really it's not, because like I said before, everyone has their own gift. Everyone has his own personality. Everyone has their own thinking about what they think about the world and basically you know, like how they and how they feel. Because you can't change, you can't you can't really say like yeah, I'm going to change the world. But that takes a lot of effort to basically to say basically to say yeah, I'm going to change the world. But I mean, I wish you good luck at it. I mean. I don't know if it's really possible. There's probably multiple people that we we've heard based on the news and stuff like that, which I'm which I'm trying not to watch it too very much. But the one the one thing I want to say here is that for, for what I think is 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 that it's just basically it's just basically you choose your path, your path, the way you want to go. Now take it as for for Gundam Gundam Seed Destiny. Now Gundam Seed Destiny does does have some similarities to basically to of of this anime. Sometimes they don't, sometimes they do, but one thing, one thing is that it really struck me the most is basically is Shin. Shin is just basically a character. He doesn't he doesn't really understand who who he who he should trust or who he not. Even though I don't think Shin is not really a bad person. And he just really is just basically he just really is not. But even though even though it's just like what Afrin says, like he can't he can't not see see the past of the words or trying to get to him, even though Afrin was helping him out. Was uh, was helping them out, but even though Afro and Shin just don't like each other, but even though Afro just wants to just wants to just to make, just wants to tell Shin, you know, th this is how we feel, this is how we do, and, and stuff like that, because you know Shin just doesn't understand, doesn't understand what what it really actually means. I mean, there's a lot of mixed up things, suspicious going on with that anime, but even though I love that anime because it was just so so unique, it really actually is. You just basically have a character like Shin. Is trying to understand what is his future, what is what does he wants to do, and then you have like this guy, like you know Chairman Duran or or you know Chairman Duran, which is, means that he's the the head boss of Zaf and stuff like that, because he's like nippling Shin's mind and stuff like that, and just trying to think that you know he's he's a he's a tool, he's a you know he has like powers and stuff like that and stuff like that, and you know that that's basically what it basically. Means. I don't I don't mean to to basically just to say just to say all that. But it really kind of reminds me of the of that. That's basically what I definitely. That's basically what I definitely do think. And you could just see these dialogues, basically just anime, you know, and just some some enemies. Some enemies will just go just be got you be on a fan source or or you know jokes or whatever maybe it is and stuff like that. But it's just some. It's just something. It's just something that I just find it very very special just to know, just to know like. How this anime really actually is this elf series of this anime. It's really actually just mind blowing. It really actually is, and I want I want to say I want to say this. I think a lot of people are going to enjoy this. It may not be for everyone, but I definitely do want to say that. But I definitely do want to say it's it's going to be something. It's going to be something that I just genuinely do think that people should go and watch this anime. Now, it's up to you. <laughs> I mean, even though I'm just basically I'm just saying. But I just figure I just want to reference in some other different things or anything like that. So so yeah, uh, I I really do love this anime. I really do I do I do want to continue watching more of this anime. I really, really do. So yeah, so uh, yeah. Anyways, so that's the end of this uh, anime review. So anyways, on the next anyways, I'll see you guys later. Take care. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe. Please consider subscribing. Uh, please hit the like button, give me a thumbs up, and please hit the notification bell as well too. So that you know you guys watch my uh, that's just letting you know you guys watch my videos. And please leave your comments below. Anyways, I love you guys. Take care. I hope you guys have a long day. Take care. God bless. Remember, just love you. I love you guys. Please be safe. And remember, stay blessed. Love you guys. Take care. Bye.